Hello once again, I am Jim Ducart with TND How Videos. Today we will watch a video on recloser control testing. Our participating utility is Commonwealth Edison in Chicago, and this video is sponsored by Omicron. Now, in North America, the latest version of the NERC PRC 005-6 standard includes recloser control tests that are part of the load shedding and restoration plans that affect the bulk electric system. All automatic reclosers affecting the BES must be maintained and tested for evidence retention, monitoring, and assessment processes in accordance with the standard. What you see here are our on-site engineers outfitted with GoPro cameras to give us a good view of the process. And they are signing their job safety briefing before going to work. You're going to see next the equipment being used. The blue box is the Arco 400 recloser control tester. Okay, Arco 400. Door. Yep, we'll go ahead and we'll make sure we're open. The door we are closed, fast trip, loop scheme disabled, so we want to come back into the same configuration when we're done. Our recloser is bypassed, so we won't have any impact on the load downstream. So go ahead and disconnect from the isolate control the control cable. cable. Good. Control cable's out. All right. Now safe. let me hook up the safe end first. Okay, she's in. Okay. Here you'll see the sequence, always plugging in dead first. On. Okay, I'm gonna go give us some accessory yeah. power. Control power, go ahead, plug your side in dead. Okay. Coming hot. Now, upon starting up the Arco, it will configure itself, and the line worker performs a trip and close check through the controller front panel to see if the recloser control is doing this basic function. You see that here on the front panel of the Arco 400. You got all three open here. Okay. And now let's go back to the truck where you can see that the Arco 400 can be operated wirelessly from the truck and do metering tests with three phase currents and six phase voltages. Okay. Beginning test. Beginning test. Test started. 10-4. Okay, I show current. I've got alpha phase current, 44.9 amps. Bravo okay. phase, 47.8. Charlie phase 49.9 amps. Looks good. Let's proceed to uh, okay. source pushings. Neutral current 4.3 amps. Now this next test you're going to see performed is called a shots to lockout test where the Arco performs a reclosing test with a phase B to ground. And here we're going to bring in the front panel of the Arco itself and you can see that it starts with a single phase reclosing and in the last test it will lock out three phase. And now the last test we are going to show in this video is called a three-phase time current curve coordination where the ARCO tests on both the fast and slow curve. Here we see two operations on the fast and two on the slow curve. And the results are automatically assessed on screen as the test is performed. Now let's look at overall results with our test report. So here's our test report. We've got a this is the test recloser we had on, on Iron Street here at the test facility with our 651R. You can see we had the Arco 400. As shown here, test results are available immediately in the truck. Assessment. Okay. All okay. And as we close with shots of the engineers closing up for this test site and moving on to the next test site, you have now seen our TND How video on recloser control testing. Once again, our participating utility was Commonwealth Edison, and this video was sponsored by Omicron. I am Jim Ducart with TND How Videos. Thank you, as always, for watching.